Hi there, and welcome to this week's episode of Thoughtful Thursdays uh, here with me live uh, streaming on LinkedIn, Facebook, and YouTube. So I want to be real quick. I'm going to try to be quick with this. Uh, just through conversations with individuals that I've had the last couple of weeks, um, you know, certainly this is a time of growth for, for many, at least that, that are in my circle. And I wanted to come on here and uh, provide some encouragement for those of you who are at you know, the various stages of, of growth uh, in your life or in your career. And so imagine with me you know, that you're holding an apple seed in your hand, right? In between your, your index and, and thumb. And you know, on site, right, when we look at it, it's just like this little black brown thing that you know, we can easily throw away or disregard. But the truth is contained within the seed is the potential to grow into an entire apple tree. And you know, many of us, when we're stepping out and we're we're or we're thinking or we're considering something new, uh, we are in seed seed stage, right? And so we know that there is a greater vision that we have for ourselves, greater vision that we have for our lives, our family, our careers, our businesses, um, but we're still in seed stage. And Sometimes what happens is that while in seed stage, because the vision appears so great and so large and it is so vastly different from where we are, we can make the decision to stay in seed stage. Um, but that's not what we want. That's not what we were going to focus on. What I'm inviting you to do is if you are in seed, seed stage, right? Hold on to that vision and allow yourself to go into the transformation chamber, is what I like to call it, that ugly part of growth, that painful part of growth that allows you to, you know, um, shed old parts of you or old parts of your identity that will not serve you at the next level so that you can become the apple. And as the apple, think about it, you know, what if we're holding an apple, it's beautiful most of the time, it's red, there's plenty of nutrients in it, and contained within it is even more seeds. So you have the opportunity to multiply yourself. And the, the greatness, right, is even more tangible at the apple stage. Um, but we can't stop there. We can't get so content and comfortable in apple stage. While, you know, maybe at apple stage, that equals the career that we want or the title that we want or the, um, you know, the amount of money that we want, the lifestyle, whatever that is, at the end of the day, if we don't go back into that cha transformation chamber, we are going to be this apple that is full of potential, full of greatness that starts to rot from the inside out. And that's not what we want either, right? Um, so the challenge then becomes for us to make a decision, even when we're comfortable, even when we've quote unquote arrived or attained the thing that we were working towards. Remember at seed form, we saw greatness, we saw a tree. So we can't stop when we get to apple form. And so that is the invitation to then go back into the ground, to go back through the process, to go back through the pruning, to go back through the harsh seasons and the harsh weather and whatever happen, whatever else happens as uh, apple trees grow. I'm, I'm not a farmer, so I don't know. But that is our invitation to go through that process because the vision was not to be an apple. The vision was to be an apple tree. And in becoming and allowing yourself to go through the process to become an apple tree, you then become this beautiful, gigantic thing, this entity that provides shade to others um, and, and not the petty shade, actual shade from the sun that provides shade, that provides nutrients to, to other people uh, season after season after season after season after season. You become this thing that is reproducing yourself over and over and over again. And not only are you benefiting, but you are benefiting multitudes. And so for those of you who step out and say, I want to do something greater, I want to I want work that has an impact or, you know, I want to be able to touch other people's lives like that is your vision manifesting. But it's not going to manifest at full in its full potential if you just allow yourself to get to Apple stage. And it's certainly not going to manifest if you allow fear or anything else keep you at seed form. And sometimes, uh, and I'll add this, sometimes the reason why we remain in seed form, some of it is fear, but sometimes we're in environments that aren't giving us the nutrients that we want to grow. And we see the potential, but we won't surrender to the process 
to, to move out of that environment and to move ourselves into an environment that will nourish us, that will give us the nutrients that we want, that will give us the protection that we need so that we can grow and develop into that next level. So that's what I have for you today. Um, I invite you to assess what stage are you in? Are you the seed in maybe not the right environment or getting ready to, to go into the transformation chamber? Are you the apple where you, you've seen some success, you've done some things, you've reproduced, and you can tangibly see and feel the greatness uh, that you've produced? Are you going to allow yourself to just get comfortable and stay there and wither and start to die and rot out from the inside? Or are you going to surrender yet again so that you become that tree? So that vision that you had of yourself, that vision of that you had of helping others and making an impact in, in, in this world and in the lives of other people, that it can actually manifest. I hope you, I hope <laughs> that you choose the latter and that you choose to go through the process. It's not fun. It's not, it's not easy. I get that. I understand. I go through it constantly. But the vision. Hold on to keep as your North Star the vision of becoming that tree so that when those not so great moments, those pressure moments come along, that you are reminded that you can remind yourself and that you can hold on to that anchor of I'm becoming a tree. And in becoming a tree, what I do, what I produce will support people for generations to come. That's all that I have for you today. Um, real quick, the Unleash Your Power Bootcamp is taking place November 30th through December 2nd. There's still spots available. Feel free to head over to sabinegideon.com forward slash bootcamp to save your spot. Again, it's sabinegideon.com forward slash bootcamp to save your spot. It's three A's one hour each day via Zoom, and we are going to dive deep, right, to help you unleash your power, regardless of what stage you're in, in the growth process. Um, the goal is to help you move through that so that you can unleash the power, that you can continue to reproduce yourself and move towards becoming that tree. That's all that I have for you today. Thank you and have a great rest of the day and a great rest of the week. Take care.